First, you're going to want to locate what's called the bullpen. This is where you'll go to check in and get ready to compete. Near the bullpen, there will be TVs, one or multiple, depending on the size of the venue. Keep an eye on these TVs because they're going to tell you when it's time to check in. When you see your name on the screen, you can go ahead and start the check-in process. For the check-in process, you're going to need your IBJJF ID. You'll hand it to the ref doing gi checks, and from here, he will make sure your gi passes all their requirements. For an in-depth look at their uniform requirements, you can check out their website. Link is in the description. Once you pass the gi check, you're going to head over to the scale. Once again, hand them your IBJJF ID and weigh in. Once you make weight, they'll give you your card back and you'll head over to the bullpen. You'll wait in the bullpen until someone calls your name and takes you to your assigned mat. Once you've been taken to the mat, the scorekeeper or referee will assign you a side of the table and that is the side you will enter the mat on. Wait there for the ref to signal you onto the mat. Once he signals you onto the mat, you will bow and walk or jog up to the ref, shaking his hand, shaking your opponent's hand, and then the ref will start the match. If you only have one opponent, it's one and done, and then it's to the podium. If there's more than one person in your bracket and you win, you'll go back to the bullpen after that match and wait for your next one. If you lose, it is single elimination, so after a loss, you are out. And that's pretty much what you can expect to see at an IBJJF tournament. I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. New videos every week. Thanks for watching.